WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this 25th of October, Friday, 11 o'clock, Tiger Financial News Network Market Update. Dow is having a bit of a bounce, up at 106 at 42,481. That nine period moving average is still good, uh, but it's really, I, by, I'd by i say by Monday, I, I would like to see uh, 48,000, uh, 40, sorry, 42,850s. Uh, that's the area I'd like to see and then maybe go higher during the week. That's going to be very important. The S&P is almost at an all-time high. It's trading at 45, at 46 and 58.55. <clears throat> and this falling X formation, the Chapman methodology, we've broken above it. Today's young. It needs to close above it. And that says then maybe it can retest the all-time high at 58. What is it? 58. Uh, I should know that. 58.78 of 46. And it's trading right now 58.54. Not a big deal. Uh, just to have a little spike to the upside. So far, it's a peak C in, a leg C in the weekly chart. What if there's a peak C this week and then next week we pop up to a D? And then all of a sudden, what do you do? If you have the QQQs trading right now at uh, 499.34, up 7, all it has to do is to go to 503.33 and you get your leg D monthly chart. Ooh, monthly chart, then all the key indices have already made at least a leg D or higher for the month of, uh, if it's in October, it does it in October, even December, uh, November. And then we're going to see what happens because that's the area where you start to be a little bit cautious. We haven't got there yet. IWM, nice balance, a little bit more actually. It's up $1.28 to $2.21. Um, it, needs, it needs to get to two. two I say $2.23.80, two $2.24.30 area. It needs to push quite a bit higher by next week, early next week. Uh, you're looking at the semiconductors, never even had a chance during my show to do it. Very strong gap to the upside. This is a good positive for the market, up five at 255. Let's go to gold. Uh, gold is up a dollar, holding really well, high level consolidation. Uh, let's go to, uh, I didn't even do silver, I'll do that right now for my show, the target conditions are. Uh, having a nice bounce of up 25 cents. High grade copper, high grade copper is eh, doing nothing. The dollar, uh, let's not do the dollar, let's go to bonds. Right now, the bonds are down 630 seconds while those yields keep creeping up. Well, they're more than creeping up. Let's go to crude oil. Crude oil right now, uh, up 67 cents. As it says right now, the bias, I think, still favors the upside in the general market. And uh, we'll see how it pans out over the next uh, few days going to Wednesday. It's going to be important. Have a wonderful weekend. Basil Chapman signing off. And I will see you Monday. Check out my opening call daily newsletter. Have a great day.